Hi, this is Anil and welcome to the video tutorial for the learning lad on C++. In this tutorial, we're going to be learning something called do while loop in C++. In the last tutorial, we have learned the while loop, you know, which is used to execute some statements again and again. And in while loops, we were testing the condition or the expression at the beginning of the loop. This do while loop allows us to execute the statement at least once regardless of whether the expression or the condition is true or false and the, the syntax is first we need to write the keyword do then the pair of uh, curly braces and between these curly braces we're gonna write the statements and then after this curly braces we're gonna write while and then in parentheses we need to write the expression and after that we need to add a semicolon so here what happens is the statement inside this block will be executed at least once and once that statements are executed you know this expression is checked here in this while if this expression is evaluated to true then again the statement will be executed and and when this expression becomes false you know the control will come out of this while loop and you know it will continue with the next statements in the program so this do while loop is very frequently used while making the menus for example if you are making any program where you need to display the menu and you want to display menu at least once and after that if the user want to see that menu again then uh, he can press some keys and uh, you know see that again so to do that or to demonstrate this do while loop we're gonna be writing a small program which is gonna print some message about the learning lad to the screen and uh, if the user want to see that message again he need to press any keys and if you want to quit he can quit that okay to demonstrate that I'm gonna create a variable which is of type char you know we're gonna store a character value entered by the user and I'm gonna call it as input all right and next we need to use the do while loop so it's gonna be do keyword and then a pair of curly braces and between these curly braces we're gonna write the message or the statements that we want to execute and then we need to write the expression inside this while and after that we need to add a semicolon so here just for the demonstration purpose we're gonna use C out and print out welcome to learning lad and then let's add a new line and in the next see our statement we're gonna say this is where you will find awesome video tutorials and again I'm gonna add the new line and now I'm gonna ask the user enter X to exit or any other key to see this message again okay and uh, we're gonna add an end line again all right the next thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna receive the input from the user and we're gonna store that in our input variable okay now we have some statements inside this block and this statement will be executed at least once when you run your program so it doesn't matter what we have in this expression whether it evaluates to true or false regardless of that the statements will be executed at least once and depending on the outcome of this expression this statement may or may not execute any other times all right now i'm gonna write the expression here so our input variable is going to contain the character entered by the user if the user enters a character x then we're going to exit this loop and uh, we're going to check that in while loop i'm going to write input not equal to and in single quotes i'm going to write x so if the input variable is containing any character other than x then execute all these statements if the user has entered the x then just come out of this do while loop all right i'm gonna save this and i'm gonna build and run this 
all right guys now you guys can see welcome to the learning lab this is where you will find awesome video tutorials enter x to exit or any other key to see this message again i'm gonna enter a key k and hit the enter button again and the message is printed again welcome to the learning lab etc etc enter x to exit or any other key to see this message again i'm gonna enter d again that message and i'm gonna enter x that's it you know the loop is terminated so this is it guys this is about the do while loop in c++ which, which is used to loop through some statements depending on the expression or the outcome of an expression all right guys thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe if you guys have any doubt don't hesitate to ask us you guys can like our facebook page and uh, stay updated with our new video tutorials so i'll see you in the next tutorial